Hi everybody and welcome to my channel Kitty and the Beast. Today we're going to make a pendant or a magnet with a horse head and flowers on it. First we take a piece of polymer clay of the base color, I chose green for mine. I roll a ball and place it on a baking paper and then flatten it to make a circle. To make the surface even and flat, I use a little bit of water and wet wipes. I decided to make a white horse with yellow mane, so white is my first color. For the head, I make a pear-like shape of white piece of polymer clay and place it right on the base. Now I flatten it and work on a more precise shape. Done, I'm taking another piece of white polymer clay to make a neck. And then just a little piece of white polymer clay for the ear. parts are put together, I am setting a place where I want to have an eye, take a small piece of black polymer clay and put it over there. And now I'm making eyelids, really thin pieces of polymer clay of white color, the base color of our horse and I put them above and below the eye of the black polymer clay I just made. Then I mark nostrils. strokes and our head is done. Now is the time for the mane. I take my yellow polymer clay and make some hairs. First one will be placed on the front and the rest will be placed on the neck. really matter where you start putting your hairs on but I have started from below this time
shape it into a little bit and then I use another tool to make some hairs on it. When the head is ready, it's time for decorating. First, I use some black polymer clay uh, to make small dots on the bottom of the pendant or the magnet. I think I will make a magnet of it. And I put those dots below and flatten them later. Then I make some flowers. First flower will be red. I use several pieces, usually I use five, and make some balls of them. Those will be my petals. Place them on the base to shape a flower. And then I press it in the middle of each petal to the base. Do the same thing with a blue and a pink flower too. with flowers I decided to decorate a base again uh, so I take a little piece of white polymer clay and make white dots all around the pendant I also flatten them, pressing them to the base, and then our pendant is ready. You just need to bake it or boil and cover with a varnish. If you like this video, please consider subscribing it and liking, and if you want to support me financially, please go to my Patreon page. Thank you very much and see you next time. Bye!